Looking ahead to the start of the Liberty Lady Flames field hockey season, their first season in the Big East Conference. And for more on that, let's visit now with the head coach of the Lady Flames, Jody Murphy, here with us. And, uh, well, Coach, you're about a couple of practices in here so far to the upcoming season. How are things going so far? Yeah, it's going really well. Um, we had a great session this morning, actually. So good, hard, competitive session with this group. We've got, um, you know, three three amazing, strong senior leaders, three captains, and then we have eight freshmen. So today I felt like even even being just our third practice, like we really took a step forward and in, in kind of getting these freshmen understanding our team culture and what hard work really looks like. So I'm I'm in a really good good spot today. Is that the biggest challenge right now is just getting the, the freshmen on the same page with everyone else being that it is such a young team? Yeah, that's a really big focus. Um, and I think it's also really good for the upperclassmen to just be reminded of some of the of some of the kind of cornerstones of the program that the, the group from before the 11 seniors we lost last year really laid the foundation of. So to me, it's it's kind of been it's a full group kind of learning and relearning some of the some of the some of the program principles. But, you know, it, it is. It's. It's the the freshmen are latching on, and they're they're more and more bright eyed, and and just willing to hear and listen and learn um, from our staff and from the upperclassmen. So, really, really feeling pretty good. Mm -hmm. Well, what when you look at the layout of your uh, practices before the start of the season here, uh, what 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 is the plan as you try to get them ready? You know, what what do you want to accomplish from week to week? Yeah, sure. Um, you know, right now we're we're looking right at some just those, like technical pieces of the game. Um, we're training high tempo in the mornings and and putting in a lot of work with just uh, you know individual skill stuff and and then smaller game stuff. Um, as we get ready for the weekend, we've actually got our first scrimmage at App State, and so we're playing at most evenings. We're playing night games, giving the girls a chance to start to understand our system, um, start to see how we press, how we outlet, and uh, just also to give them a chance to just play. You know, I think sometimes when you get into preseason, it can just be the grind, and to me, um, the, the playing is the fun stuff, and we've got a, quite a long preseason, so carving out that time to still play and enjoy all the stuff you're taking in the morning session and really seeing it emerge in the evening games to, for a coach is, is really exciting. How do you feel about the makeup of your roster? Because you've got the Bar Sisters back, obviously. There, There's a couple of names that folks recognize. But uh, with so many young uh, players coming in, how do you feel about the makeup and the talent level? I feel really good. Um, we've got a lot of new faces, certainly. Um, but the core group that was training with us in the spring, um, there was about yeah, ten of those girls. Like they are, um, they're they're they took a step forward, and I feel like they are gonna are gonna really come back and and kind of set the tempo. Um, they've already they've already kind of started to do that. Um, and then yeah, we've got we've got in us I think a couple of freshmen that have the chance to to start right now, and we also have uh, a young lady from Argentina, Aggie, who's been training with us since the spring, but wasn't cleared to compete until this fall. When you look at the schedule, you mentioned uh, exhibition games coming up here. You've got uh, William and Mary at home, but then you got five straight away to start the season, and these aren't just any road games. I mean, we're talking James Madison, we're talking Duke, we're talking Syracuse, UVA, Villanova to open conference play. Uh, what do you want to find out about your team in that stretch? You know, I think with that, I think it's um, first and foremost, it's just I want to see their heart. You know, I want to see the them embrace the opportunity to come up against some of the best programs in the country. We've never been a program that shied away from strong, good competition. Um, having the opportunity to play the national champion from last year is something that, you know, I think competitors dream about and what I appreciate about this group is and this staff is that we are competitive people and you know those types of games those teams are you know that's where we want to be and we want to be competitively you know in the top 10 year after year after year so having the opportunity to get a group of girls that are excited about that and aren't afraid, aren't timid, you know, they're playing in a spirit of freedom and a spirit of, you know, joy and not one of timidity is something that we really try to drive out early. So I'm hoping, you know, that we'll be confident. We'll learn something from each game. We're going to gain something from all of those opponents. And, um, you know, we come out strong. We, we can't really uh, sit back and kind of wait for conference play. We got to get out of the gates early and really these practices now um, count for that for sure. 
Big East Conference tournaments November 4th through the 6th in Philadelphia. Uh, Big East play this year. How much have you had a, a chance to kind of evaluate some of the other teams in, in the league and still while looking at your own and, and getting them ready? Yeah, we, we kind of had a feeling like, praise God, that, you know, the Big East might work out. So last year, in anticipation of that, we were able to schedule um, three of the Big East opponents. And, and so in so doing, I think we, you know, got some exposure and we got to see some playing styles and, um, you know, really, really kind of see what we're coming up against and and there's a ton of great teams within that league and i think for us we'll we'll of course each game we'll we'll see more and more about these opponents but um you know it's just just making sure that um we're prepared and we have an understanding of of what these these teams are capable of doing and and um our girls again being eager and and ready to go we're we're constantly talking about the Big East. We've got new branding all around the field, um, so it's a it's a certain it's a definite focal point for this group. Um, they've really latched onto it, and we're really really excited to have the opportunity to compete in one of the best conferences in the country. Coach, appreciate the time. Yeah, appreciate you guys coming out. That's Jody Murphy, the head coach of the Liberty Lady Flames field hockey team. My name is Nick Pierce for the Liberty Flames Sports Network.